2008 National Championships pregame show, the last pregame show of 2008. And before we get started with the lower bracket, lower half of the winner's bracket round one, I want to give a quick shout out to all of our fans watching from overseas once again. Thank been you. flooding my inbox on Xbox Live with all kinds of crazy messages in all kinds of different accents. And also different languages. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> all say some ridiculous stuff. All the above. We love you guys. Thanks for tuning in. Now, guys, let's break it down. We got four teams remaining. The first match we're going to talk about, it's the team that just won Dallas. Triggers down our number two seed. They've won two events so far this season, and they're going to be facing a team that has struggled all season long in carbon. Well, you said it. They're coming off a win from Dallas. I expect them to bring all the momentum from Dallas right here into Vegas. Now, when you talk about Triggers Down, you got to look at this team as a team with pure, raw talent. All of them can go off at any time. Each player catches fire throughout a series. It's awesome. Expect SK to lead his troops. He gets them in check. He just runs strategies. He's awesome. Everybody knows he's great at that. And Hysteria. This kid goes nuts. I've talked about it a bunch of times. Hysteria! <laughs> yeah, what's the song? Do you want to sing the song? Let's skip that, actually. Right. Not gonna embarrass Chris. I'll got you later, though. Hysteria. He has, he's in the top three for stats and slaying ability for a reason, and I think he's going to show it in Vegas. Then you got Fear Itself and Karma. These guys are monsters. Expect them to be the glue for the team and fill out wherever they need to be. And again, they'll catch fire whenever they need. All right, now I'm going to ask you, Nexi. Yep. Who is going to be the player to watch from Triggers Down this event? Hysteria. I know I was told not to say it. He's the Jesus of Halo. Well, hysteria is the man. I don't even care. <laughs> One touch on He's Hysteria. So <laughs> One touch on Hysteria. He is the only player in Halo 3 history to have the best kill to death ratio and most time in a tournament. How that's good crazy. is he? He's, he's that's literally crazy. All right, that's enough really about Triggers Down, guys. In Dallas. <laughs> let's, let's talk about DMAX Super Fan Club. It's Team Carbon. <laughs> the 2006 national champions, the runners up in 2007. What can they do here in well, 2008? Well, that's exactly why you can't count them out, Chris, because they are the 2006 champions. They are the 2007 runner-ups. They've been around Vegas before. They know exactly what it's about. Carbon, led by Ghosty Ami, led by Shockwave. These guys are ready to play. For the first time this year, they've coming off a uh, off a land with straight ripping. They looked good. They only lost the land 40 to 28. The Carbon is ready, man. To your carbon point, is Mac, really I was ready. talking to Eric earlier, Ghost Ayami, excuse me. He said we're going to see a Carbon that we've never seen before. He said we're more prepared this tournament than we've been all season. I think Carbon's going to show up to play. I wouldn't be surprised if the series is a lot closer than people think. All right, well, Carbon, of course, they took a team to game five. I think it was final boss, right, in the early rounds First of round Dallas. Dallas. So you got to look out for this squad. They've been around for a while. They're veterans. They know what they're doing. And you yep. know what? Nated is in the house, <laughs> and he's got a big smile this weekend. So, guys, that is the first matchup. That is the top of the bottom of the winner's bracket <laughs> round one. Now we're going to talk about the second match we're going to be commentating, the match I've been waiting for, the match I'm super pumped for, probably the most pumped for in winner's bracket round one. It's going to be our number three seed, final boss, facing off against the six seed ambush. Well, this is final boss, guys. These are, these are the people that have won three out of the last four national championships in MLG. These guys three are... Three out of four. Three so out of four. We've had four national championships, and Final Boss has won three of them. 75%. All right, that's good. And, and, and you can't bet against the Twins. Ogre 1 and Ogre 2 have dominated the circuit for as long as we can remember. With strong side and with the addition of the best Halo 3 player in the game, Neighbor, Final Boss is mentally prepared, they're physically prepared, they're ready to go. And next to you, of course, Final Boss, the three-time champions. They're going to be facing off against a team that has pulled off some incredible upsets, a team that you have been a super fan of yep. all season long. It's Ambush. Everybody knows I love Ambush, but i got to give a little credit to FB. I was an FB fan. I really was. They let me down this season. Was. That's why I was. I love the Ogres. I'm a Halo 1 player. The Ogres were incredible. But this season, I can't do it. I'm going with Ambush on this one, and this is why. You got Hines. He has the best awareness in the league. This kid's unstoppable. Pistola. You see the smartest player here? He's a little 16-year-old running around looking like a super genius with a sniper rifle. Then you got Cloud and Nexus just backing him up. Yeah, I said it. Super, super genius. genius with a sniper He's rifle. A brainiac. <laughs> I love it. These guys are the underdogs. They've upset the number one team not once, but twice. They proved they could do it. And coming into this tournament, I was talking to Heinz, and he goes, we're the final boss killers. These guys are preparing to beat final boss. 
they, the, the dedication toward beating Final Boss exceeds what Final Boss is doing to, beat, to win this tournament. Does that make sense? Oh, it makes plenty it makes of sense. sense. It makes and sense. And you know what, Nexi? I'm pretty pumped right now. We're in the Dr. Pepper Ultimate Gaming House. And back behind your left shoulder, there is a member of Ambush. There He's he looking is. away right now. We got <laughs> Cloud sitting down here. And we got Heinz and Hines. Nexus sitting Nexus. up on the balcony. These guys are pumped for the weekend. And you know what? There's Cloud. There yeah, he is. he's looking good. He's smiling on, on the camera. Wave to the camera, Cloud. <laughs> there you go, guys. I know all of our community members, this is the team they're rooting for. They love the underdogs. Ambush looking to pull off a huge upset over Final Boss in round one. And Nexi, you told me, Final Boss, they've been preparing for big names like Straight Ripping, exactly. Triggers Down. Who is Ambush preparing for? Ambush is the Final Boss killers, they said it themselves. They're coming in to win round one. Final Boss, understandably, is looking to win the tournament. Ambush is doing the right thing here, and that's why I'm putting my money on Ambush's chip. Or right, here we go. This is my Ambush chip right here. I'm putting it down. All right. Well, next he's got his money on Ambush's chips. Whatever. Anyway. <laughs> and Dmac, I want to know. I know Nexi's calling Ambush to pull the upset over Final Boss. What's your take here? Uh, I'm gonna have to disagree with him. These are. This is Vegas, man. Uh, these are the championships. These are where the ogres shine. This is where strong side plays his best. Final boss is going to come out to play. They're going to come out to play strong, and they're going to come to play to win. Sure. All right, guys. Now, I know, that, speaking of bets, we got a big bet going on. <laughs> One of you is going to have to change your gamer tag to either Nexi owns me or DMAC owns me. That's right. They have their brackets <laughs> predicted on MLGPro.com <laughs> slash Vegas Picks. Let's check it out right now. We got DMAC's bracket. My bracket is so good. <laughs> So good. He's got Straight Rippin' facing off against Instinct. Straight Rippin' advancing to the winner's bracket finals on top. And then in the bottom, Trigger's down facing off against Final Boss. And then he's got Final Boss pulling off the I upset do. over the Dallas champions. So he's expecting a Straight Rippin' Final Boss finals. Meanwhile, Nexi, he's getting rebellious here. He's oh, calling yeah. off some oh, yeah. upsets. Let's check out Nexi's a bracket. Fresh bracket over here. You know, he's copying DMAC, of course. I would agree with him there as well. On top, straight rip and advance to the winner's bracket finals. And then in the bottom, Trigger's down facing Ambush. Trigger's down getting the best of Ambush to advance to the winner's bracket finals for a straight rip and Trigger's down rematch. Guys, best of luck to both your brackets. You know, neither of them are the same as mine. I wish I could show it, but I probably should hold it till later. We'll have to we'll see, see how that plays later. out. And I'll make sure you, you guys stay tuned. Check out that site, mlgpro.com slash VegasPicks all weekend long. One of these guys is going to get embarrassed by the end of the weekend. Well, guys, that is going to wrap it up for our winner's bracket picks for Halo 3. When we come back, we're going to be talking about all the other games that are going to be featured here in Las Vegas, the 2008 National Championships, right after a quick commercial break. I'll pay for you to.